Ya brada po adumochire ene eye Captain Smarty. Ye ni miso mukis ni kwa nko mweja ya asumji aba. Wedi eme se nyambaye. Na ye diye na kofa wye nyina aba. Onse okwa ye program. Bita mwamu ko eye ba umia eye program. Nasina generalist ne kwa yeno. Ano okwa kwa se wa kova kova stations. Bia hudu wubi biwa yi London ni adi ati. Captain Babo niti wasu wabwa. Na ana ufo mesa abe kensi kase mnusu di eni peso. Enu na po adumochire etina se. Ewo onusu good evening gana so ono. Inti ha wuzi ye na analysis. Somebody gave that. And it's been discussed around for a while. And I feel that the journalists are being battered for doing nothing wrong. And it's the journalists who are doing that. The people who are talking like that. Those who speak sit in the morning and wear black spectacles. Are they saying? <laughs> are they have not never attended an event and be compensated before? Um, are they saying that they, they even way. take money? Some of those people. Uh, they take money for they immoral they conduct. Like. They take money to come and sit on radio to insult people. And they collect money that give me money, let me go and insult Paul Adomachi. Give me money, let me go and insult Napo. Give me money, let me go and insult Akufuado. Give me money, let me go and insult Baumia. Give me money, let me go and insult Danboche. They do that. They do. All the time. Those people. And then they are concerned that a press conference has been uh, 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 delivered by the vice president and the presidential candidates for the NPP. And they say that journalists went there, journalists were paid 20,000. That's corruption. Let's get to the story. So, uh, this is what we wrote. <laughs> Journalists don't have to be paid to attend Baumier's press conference, but they need to be sufficiently compensated, shouldn't they? And viewers, I ask you the question. Shouldn't they be sufficiently compensated? Yes, we understand that journalists are not to be paid. Their media houses pays them. The salaries for media houses. But they have to be compensated. I don't see the hula baloo about it. You are holding a press conference on a Sunday. The journalists who are married and have children, they are spending time with their family on a Sunday. The journalists who are not married, they are spending time with their girlfriend and boyfriend on a Sunday. They are watching football on a Sunday. They'll come to work on Monday. You ask them to come to Kempiski on Sunday, and we all think that they shouldn't be compensated. Some of the journalists came from outside Accra. Those who are coming from outside Accra, they should buy their own uh, bus tickets and plane tickets. Okay, it's a poor adomotry. Ebeki can win in a win. And a captain smart to see, poor adomotry the boy. Especially, now say me no beka wa bo and tinsi wa kokova a landing for programs bia who do be tama naba womia a gina sim piece one was who be a musana question. And a captain smart bar bo and tin beka so boa. Ubu hoa and tis asem and I win him as a mukra maker. I seem win a poor adomotry the cocoa. I also covered the UK election in 2001 for Tony Blair, and I covered also the UK election in 2019. Okay. And some way, I don't know Captain Smart, I don't know what to do. 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 I do Onzo di tu ya bro mo. Oyen Centroni na me mpese me bo ni din. Oyen Trofo Chen obi a. O se dey o cover UK elections oboa. Time na 1991. UK for two abanu we dey mfie say 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 o mfie say. Cause o se on dey 50. It take 1991, 92, 93, 94, 95, 96. 1991 kura be seen there. Eh how many years? But o manya calculation e mami. When you follow a liar, you become a liar. Principle of two. 1991, ABC 2024. 33 years. Paul Adwatch is only 50. Now, 33 years, you know, when you take it, if you have a Paul Adwatch, you 50. 33 years. What is 33 feet 20, uh, 50? What is 30 feet 20? We eat 3 feet more, I can 17. I was talking to him, sir. I started Metro TV. I do not know 17 years. You see, when you follow a liar, the principle of two, you become a liar. When you follow a corrupt person, you become corrupt. That guy is a liar. If a media person tells you, sir, I cover elections, sir, just on the TV, you know, so. Okay. AT, according to Captain Smart. And so better now, Bontin was a year, a year poor, do much at Obwa. One cover be bia. Sad time roll the calculate if any age in any idea, dear, waiting by country the gunner for say, or cover be bina one wine. And to wait not poor, do much at it, and so says, I'll tell you, and one paper be dincomo. 
en wasa so ba sa analysis ne so bi mo ani tua ne task screen no wasa bi jina so en ye na enya so in the black spot skills in the early morning i don't understand him i say i covered elections in 1991 I mean, a very cursory appreciation will show you that there was no election in UK in 1991. What is wrong with him? There was no election in UK in 1991. I'll show you what I said. I said 2001, and I mentioned Tony Blair. There was no Tony Blair in 1991. 1991, British Prime Minister was Margaret Thatcher. There was no election in 1991. There was an election in UK in 1992. It was won by John Major. Tell him that there was no election in... Uh, just a Google. Google would have showed him that there was no election in UK in 1991. And I didn't say 1991. I said 2001. And I mentioned Tony Blair. Just even listening, they can't listen. Just listen to it. He can't listen. And then he says, what? It's a lie? This is the photograph. It's here. First of all, show the photograph of myself and David Lamy. This is 2001 in covering the UK elections. I was detailed to be at a constituency uh, called... Um, a Tottenham, Tottenham Hill constituency, just next to Enfield Southgate. This is myself and, and, uh, and David Lamy. David Lamy was the Labour parliamentary candidate for the constituency. And this, I, was, I was deployed there because this is a constituency that has Ghanaians and Jamaicans. Uh, so forget my big suit and, and uh, all that. This is me in 2001 covering the UK election in 2001 for the BBC. And that's David Lamy. David Lamy later became a minister for education under Gordon Brown. And he visited Ghana. Of course, he had forgotten about this incident. So he visited Ghana and the British High Commission thought he should come and have an interview on Good Evening Ghana. Whilst we were having an interview on Good Evening Ghana, I reminded him that I had covered the UK election with him in 2001 when he was running for the first time as parliamentary candidate for Labour. This is that experience back at Good Evening Ghana sometime in 2010. Have a look. We have David Lamy. David Lamy is member of parliament, uh, MP. Um, as they say in UK, right? Honorable David Lamy is MP for Tottenham. And Tottenham, um, uh, those of you who've been to London so many times know that it's a big uh, community that people in Ghana have interest. Uh, so I'll be talking to David Lamy tonight about, about Tottenham and about why he's in Ghana. He's the um, minister, um, if you like. We say minister in Ghana. He's a minister responsible for higher education in the United Kingdom. And he's been here on some official assignments. He's been to the University of Ghana and he's, he's been having some discussions with the Ministry of Education. So I'll, I'll let him talk about that. Um, so let me welcome. Thanks for being yeah, It's a you. pleasure. You look very different from nine years ago when I saw you. <laughs> and uh, I'd like viewers to see this. Can, can we see the, the photograph? You know, I was in London at, uh, at that time uh, working for the BBC and uh, uh, David was, uh, was competing for the Tottenham seat. He, had, he was already in there. He was competing for another term. And um, I encountered him, so we had a, a discussion. Well, the, the, the scan uh, it should be coming up now. Uh, the photographs of David and I. Can you put it on uh, as soon as you can, please? Um, anyway, David, welcome to Ghana. What brings you to Ghana, by the way? Well, you're right. Uh, things have changed. Okay, that's it. That, that's it. Uh, so it's... Uh, on your left is Paul Adamochi, and on your right is David Lamy, MP of Tottenham. <laughs> wow. So please, tomorrow morning, tell Opana that I really did cover the elections in UK in 2001. And in Ghana, I didn't say 1992. I said 1998, the MPP contest. And I've covered 98 election in MPP, 2000, the national election, 2001, the UK election, 2002, the internal NDC contest, 2004, the uh, presidential election, 2010, the contest between Professor Mills, Espio Gabriel, and Ediana, and Akufado, and Alain Chamatin, 2012 election, 2016, 20, 20, 20, 20 now, and then 24 coming. And that's, that's the kind of journalism they do. See, see this is our friend here. Uh, he, he, he's there and the West African Media Foundation. They say that the things that his Bobia has been saying is, un, is unsubstantiated, that they do radio programs and uh, call themselves journalists only to come and insult people and do unsubstantiated things. The things that they say is unsubstantiated. The things that you say in journalism must have the biggest foundation and, and, and must be the pivot around which society revolves. You cannot be a journalist and be talking and be told by a research organization that what you do is full of insults and unsubstantiated. I'm not sure why the National Media Commission is not saying anything about it. That the person calls himself a journalist, he's doing a radio program, and then a research institution goes in, research into his work for a period, and comes to the conclusion that 90% of what he says is unsubstantiated or it is insults. And then they feel that 
it's, it's okay. They think it's okay. That's up to them. Uh, but we will not fall for those low standards. Professor P. A. V. Ansan used to write something. He says that uh, he will he will not descend into the gutter with them, but he will rise up to the standard of the ivory tower and make sure that the standards of journalism are continuously high. May he rest in eternal peace, and we will make sure that the standards of journalism are continuously high. Not this kind of journalism where the Media Foundation for West Africa comes to the conclusion that the things that he says are either insults or is unsubstantiated. And that is the content of a full radio program, a full media program, which has been assessed to say that what he says is unsubstantiated and is full of insults. But some people applaud it. Let's move on. Let's move on. Let's move on. <laughs> Et chidi bi diswa captain smart bu bi ansa mu nyina eh obetibi lo adwen chira ba captain eni eya po hello ebusi afo so o pesi fita asura cho do for there and they enough awu kodom unique laser whitening unique laser whitening i want to paste to strong kwa o di chuchu o sin e ma o sin eya fita na eya fita no nso no na eyi en carbon e bia e wo wo no mu bia any tea stain Coffee stain, smoking stain, sibia, unique laser whitening product. Ebe yi ni nyine efri suwa ma wakama, kama, kama. Di ya obaya ni se, uchu so, na odi biye gu, o brush do so. Na odi e chuchu, sinisu nyina, kama, uju ya, en wuhu wenu mjano, wenu msa. Inti ufre, unique laser whitening, ewa 079-9979-2330. Unique laser whitening, o se, Muni ses. Mpene fosi bibi wawi asinti ni eda. Ni atupunu. Na nepa boni funti. E wose umo bambo unhiyo. Na nepa pemudie. Pro Technologies. Ana mika mfama wo. Ane. Pro Technologies. We are specialized in both sales and installation of CCTV cameras. Yeton. Esa install CCTV cameras. In the saw gun. And now sa broche rate. Now ufi o gun. Now beso ye CCTV camera installation. We need Pro Technologies. And in saw so. We need CCTV camera installation. Electric fence. Automated gate. Access control. Video door. Bell and our intercom and our satellite TV home theater so we pay biato and our water and our person be installing mouth pro technologies and our self fryer now shining so say a video you name from America but you may this and papa now pedia man you know none of us would that form make sure you know the web but you may have any a branch our Ghana you need more brow brain into sick of fire and same safe and yet you're part of Ghana would die Da. Nani ye tene se, ye sanye general construction. So we brochure, na peso si fi o gana. E da yi plan yi bia o peso si. Se wa sha si dada, anafe na peso si. Plan yi bia, ye besi yama. E nwe chi so yi solar power. Anabamba hon sen sen di adye. Woni ye nin sa waso. Ni ye sansu ye smart home. A pe fun fi di e bia o peso si se. E wo fi ye, anawa chuba mwa de ma wo. Woni ye nin sa waso. We are just a call away. Ni ye sansu wa dan de ma hain. Anafe brochure be du gana. Na upe full house, room, ana apartment sa hain. For short term and a long term, ye be mo biyani border form. Na bamba hon sem die, men yene hon. En na ye ye interior decoration. So wasi fi ye ne ri, and na ye su fi ye ne ma ono. Ye sign decoration, ye be si ye si ye uti ye, and na office ho, e di amao. And we ati so watom fi di ye bi, na wo wo kwe ya fast way install it. And na ni settings, ye be ye, e di amao. E wo gana, ube hu ye, wo emre o fra denta, e di wo di anche do do wa. Ube hu ye, e wo ashi ye, ye ni emal informasi, e ne wo the same building mo. For information, or what's up, 401-757-30. Zero and a plus four zero one six nine nine two two five four. Pro Technologies. We have the solutions for your security and home entertainment needs at affordable prices. I don't know.